What's happening? So it's a lovely, a lovely, 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 a lovely <laughs> South Florida day, right? It's kind of hot. Let me turn the camera around. It's kind of hot. It is. It's very hot. It's very hot. And um, I just came from. I just came from the gas station. I, I need some some petrol, right? I'm not working today. I'm off today. And I needed some. I need some gas. I, I was about to say fuel. <laughs> but I'm not, I don't need any fuel today. Maybe tomorrow. Definitely tomorrow. Maybe. For sure. But um. I uh I went to get some gas and so I, I was getting some gas and I was getting some ice and uh, a couple of teas and so I actually went in and asked the guy I went in and asked the guy you know I was gonna pay for my gas I got ready to pay for my gas before I pay for my gas I said um but let me use your bathroom and he said um, the bathroom not working I said okay. So then I, I grabbed my grab my ice and I got the tea. And I'm like, I thought about it, I said, well, well um, you here all day. You here all day. But some of these places, some of these places you go to, especially in certain areas, you know, they say that stuff, but the bathroom does work. Cause I, I be, the reason why I know, and I thought about it, the reason why I know for a fact that some of them work is because they say that. And I make deliveries. And they can have the auto, they have the auto, had an out of order sign in some of these communities, in some of these areas, they have an out of order sign on, on the door, and they say you can't use the bathroom. But when I made the deliveries at these certain places, I say, man, I got, I can't use the bathroom. He said, well, give me the key. He said, go ahead, and, and the bathroom's clean, nothing wrong with it, right? And so that came to my mind at this place, at this gas station here, and I'm like, so I asked him, so what do you use? And he said, I use a bottle. Like he said, <laughs> it's not what he said. It's not what he said. It's how you said it, you know what I mean? He said, I use a bottle, like like with an attitude, like like with authority and an attitude. I said, yeah, oh yeah, I use a bottle. He said, yeah, I use a bottle. I said, okay, I, I, left, I left the ice. <laughs> I left the ice. I left the, well, the teas I was gonna buy. I left all that on the counter and said, well, well, you, you put that up. And, and, and I, didn't, I didn't get any gas. I, I, I need gas, I need gas. I, I'm not gonna, I hope I don't run out. I'm not gonna run out because it's like, well, I'm at, it's like a couple places that, uh, that uh, you know, what I mean, that I can get gas from, but I just had to come on. I had to come on and share that because a lot of times, especially like certain areas, a lot of times, you know, we put up put up with stuff. And I think I, I did a video about this a while ago. I was at 7-Eleven, and I had an issue. I had an issue with the guy at the 7-Eleven, but that was months ago. And now going to that store, that guy treats me so good. But a lot of times, they have a certain Im image of certain people. People. Mainly us, African American people, that have a certain image of us and certain thoughts about what they hear and they don't really know. And once you go in there, but it shouldn't be like that. It shouldn't be like that. And once they know, know um, the type of person you are, they can see it. Like you going, me going in there all the time. But I had, I had stopped for a while. And I actually had to cuss the guy out, and that's not me. But like, I, you know, I, I'm not a fighter. But if I have to, you put, put me in the corner, I'm gone. I'm going to defend myself, and so sometimes people people push your buttons, people push your buttons and put you in a corner, and nobody puts nobody puts baby in a corner. <laughs> some of y'all may know where that comes from. I'm trying to find a place to park. Somebody, some of y'all may know where that comes from. You all, y'all, may know that comes from. It comes from our dirty dancing. We said the guy Patrick Page comes in, comes in there, and uh, the dad, you know, they were doing, they're doing the last dance of the season. And uh, he, he comes in and says, um, he says, uh, it, it gets, uh, the, I forgot, oh, shit, I'm going the wrong way. Talking to y'all, I'm going the wrong way. But uh, he, he, he um, takes takes her and, and gets her and says, uh, still going the wrong way. He says, uh, nobody puts baby in the corner. And so that's where I get that from. But anyhow, but yeah, like I was saying, I'm going the wrong way. I'm going to get in trouble. But um, but yeah, like I say, you know, I was saying like I, I'm not a, I had to like focus because I'm, I'm actually going in the wrong direction. Lucky no cars are coming. I'm actually at the, in the Publix Plaza. And it's, it's, it used to be a big mall here. It used to be the Dairy Mall. It shut that down. It used to be a movie theater there. It shut that down too. 
But uh, anyhow, so yeah, the guy, the guy, I, I, I got into it with the guy, and like he, when he sees me now, you know, I don't know, I don't know what he was thinking, but when he sees me now, you know, he, he's, he's, I go, back, I still go in there every now and then. That's when, like, when it's something I need and I, know I can't get it from anywhere else. And I know they have it. I go in there and get it. But he treats me well. I haven't had an issue with him since since uh, since I, we had words. And um, but like I say, sometimes not sometimes, but people need to start with whether 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 it's a place you like or you know I know it's definitely will. Like, like some of these uh, restaurants, some of these salons, like if you go and get your hair done, your nails done, and then people don't treat you, or anywhere for that matter, you know, if people treat you a certain way, uh, you can feel the energy, and if you, like they treat you, and you're gonna spend your money, why would you spend your money there? If the people give you an attitude, like I can understand people having a bad day, but you know, something like that, you know, I, and I thought it was kind of funny, the way he said it, like, <laughs> He uses the bottle to use the bathroom. Like you gonna you gonna you gonna what kind of bottle you use? You gonna sit out like you driving a truck? <laughs> that's what truck drivers use. We use we use, that's what I used to use the bottle. Like you don't want to stop. And, and if you do stop, if you're driving long distance and for miles and miles, there's no rest stops, no gas stations. So what you gonna do? You gotta if you're gonna pull over, you're gonna pull over. You're gonna go behind the curtain, close the curtain, because you know you got a camera, got I spy watching you. So you go behind the curtain. Just a little tip for those truck that people that are not truckers. Like you go behind your curtain, and I use the bathroom. And, and if you if you eat if you eat crazy, you might have to go number two. And like some people have buckets in there. Some people have buckets. I don't want to gross you out, but uh, it's the truth. You know, people have buckets and they have like cat litter inside the bucket. So when you have to go number two, you go inside the bucket. You know, you have like a little thing, like a little like, like a little a little seat. And you have like a little bucket, and you have a cat inside the bucket, and when you use it, you just, you know, you have to catch it or whatever, and you throw it out. I rinse the bucket out and throw it out. But I think he said that he kind of, he kind of got on, he kind of uh, said, I like, forget it, you know, I'm not finna spend my money here. So uh, I actually left it, left the stuff that I was gonna buy, I left it out on the counter. And he said, he just looked at me and was like, just put it up, buddy. But, you know, I, I wanted to come on and share that. And I hope, in hopes that, in hopes that you know, if if, if you if you tolerate stuff, certain things from these certain stores, no matter what store you're in, don't tolerate stuff you're spending your money. That, that's a little guns tip for the day. You know, I know I haven't haven't done guns tip in a while, but um, stop spending your money. That's a guns tip for the day. Stop spending your money on people that that don't appreciate you, appreciate your your because uh, you don't have to you don't have to spend your money with them. You know, it's a lot of a lot of these stores selling the same thing. So whether you whether you Whatever it is, it don't matter. Whatever it is, whether you're in a fast food place, because some of these fast food places, like people, I don't even, I can't even understand how they can hire certain people for certain, certain. You can't work in customer, you can't work in customer service, and have a bad, and have a bad attitude. You can't. How can you be in customer service and you have a bad attitude? I can understand. You know, you have a bad day. As you see, I'm kind of passionate about this this, this topic. <laughs> but you can't, you can't work in customer service and have a bad day. I mean, not have a bad day, but guess can't have a bad attitude. You know, you got you like that's one of like this is one of my favorite stores. And I'm not saying I used to work here either. Let me show you. The, let me show you this. For the most part, I've made an issue about it before, but this place here, Publix, one of my favorite spots. And you know why? You know why it's one of my favorite spots? Because they teach. This one of they was what they're built on. The brand is built on customer service and, and, and how you treat your customers. But, you know, in certain places, they're not as good, they're bad. For the most part, that's what that's what their store is bred on. That's what, that's what they teach their employees to do, to, to be, to be uh, customer oriented and treat, treat the customers with, with uh, respect. Speak to them when they come in, say hello, can we help you with anything? You can find everything you need. You know what I mean? And if you spend your money, that's how it should be. You, should, you shouldn't meet somebody with an attitude. And uh, especially like the way he said it, like I use a bottle. Like I'm thinking I'm gonna spend my money. After you done said that, that kind of like hurt my nerve. I know, I know it's a lie. <laughs> you go sit, it don't, it don't, it don't, it don't change. Even if you don't let people use the bathroom, maybe you know, I don't know. But if I'm spending money, I should be able to use the restroom. If not, I go somewhere else and use it. I spend my money there, like like I'm doing here. I'm going to Publix. I, I might not get the gas here. Can't get no gas at Publix, but. Maybe one day they may change things, 
But I don't want to bore you with that. I'm gonna put my windows up and go inside the store. I don't. I didn't want to bore you with that. I just want to come on and share because it was on my heart to share. You know, sometimes, sometimes things aggravate you, and I ain't really aggravated. I just feel like it's a point that needs to be made because we do it. We do it. We tolerate it, and we we don't have to. And we need to stop it. Stop it. And the only way you stop it is if you stop going to these stores and, and stop spending your money with them. If, if you let them act treat you a certain way and, and, and still, still spend your dollars with them, they'll continue to do what they do. So anyway, y'all be safe, y'all be blessed. And uh, don't forget to like, subscribe, comment down below. Kiss the ones you love, you never know when you can kiss them again. Tell somebody, love, tell somebody you love them because you never know when you can tell them again. Y'all be safe, y'all be blessed. Enjoy your day. And I'm out. Peace.